We are getting to the end of the hold period for the 30 dogs that came here on March 2nd as a result of a Sheriff's Office investigation. We are preparing to rehome a small number of those dogs, eight of those dogs. Unfortunately, we are going to have to also prepare to euthanize the remainder of those dogs. That's a, a very challenging thing for us, a very difficult thing to do, but something that we do think has to be done given the nature of North Carolina's laws regarding fighting dogs. We certainly know that there is dog fighting in North Carolina. There have been several notable cases in recent years, some of which have involved the FBI. It is uh, illegal, it is cruel, it is criminal. Effective deterrence against dog fighting it depends upon effective investigations and prosecutions, and it depends on people in the community who may be prone to fight animals really recognizing that there are sanctions or penalties for doing so. Our staff has been really creative in caring for them and enriching their experience here and uh, within the constraints that we need to keep them in to assure their safety and the safety of our staff. I think that we have really done a good job of assuring that their health is good and, and that they're receiving the attention that they need while they're here.